I'm back again on day three of our skincare routine talk based on the 10 step um, Korean skincare. So step number three, um, they talk about um, exfoliation. So this is a very tricky subject because um, some people might say you need to exfoliate daily. Some people may need you need to exfoliate two or three times. My personal recommendation is either once or twice a week. It, but that depends on like where you are with your skin. With my skin, I only exfoliate once a week um, because the the only reason for that is there is a, 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 a resurfacing cream that I sometimes use once a week as well, which then I alternate I alternate with my exfoliating uh, pads from Elemis, which is why I'm saying I use it once. So for you, you have to know your skin and decide for yourself if you have to um, exfoliate daily. If you have oily skin, probably chances are you will have to exfoliate daily. Um, and then if you've got dry skin, you might have to use um, certain product, um, you know, for your dry skin when you product when you exfoliating. So basically, there's different types of exfoliation and the one that I use, I'm going to talk about the one that I use, it's the, uh, I'm using the Dynamic Resurfacing Facial Pad, which is by um, Elemis and basically they are these pads, they are soaked, god they smell so nice, yeah, they are soaked in a, a liquid and they come in 60 in these ones actually, so well, 60, so I use once a week. So this actually really lasts me. I know somebody might say they're a bit pricey, but, you know, depending how many times you use them. But my sister, who's got sensitive skin, she uses gel. This one is by Nip and Fab, which is quite a good brand. Um, because, like I said to you, depending on your skin how you exfoliate and what you use would depend on your skin type and what is it that you want to achieve with your skin so at the end of the day it's all about what's in the ingredients and those ingredients are the ones that sort of like determines which ones you need for your skin so again it goes back to the facts that I always tell people you need to know your skin. If you don't know the type of skin that you've got, then you're going to end up using the wrong products, which are going to do more damage than good. So basically, whether you use the Elemis or you use the Nip and Fab, again, it would depend on your skin. So know your skin type and, you know, then... By the time you add your third skin, you will know which type of exfoliation uh, you need. And why do we exfoliate? Like I've said, we exfoliation helps us with getting rid of the dead skin because apparently we shed a lot of um, dead skin. We carry a lot of dead skin as days go by. So if you don't remove the, those dead cells, then they sort of like block your skin. So whatever products that you might be using on your skin like on the surface like your topical creams will not work if your pores and your skin is clogged up with dirt and dead skin so for them to work you need to remove that dead skin and get a new layer out and then you can use your um, product your topical creams then they can get inside your skin and do what they need to do so yeah that is the third step the third step on um the 10 step Korean skincare routine. So tomorrow I'll be seeing you guys for the step number four. And if you haven't seen the other first two steps, I will link the video on the description box um, down here on this video. And then you can watch that one before you watch this one. But obviously they go as in step, they'll be following each other like that. So I'll be seeing you tomorrow for step number four. And if you've liked this video, please do give us a like or a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so that you can see the rest of the upcoming videos. 
Other than that, I will be seeing you guys tomorrow on the next video. Bye!